Welcome to Digital Conversion Tech Tutorials Lesson 6 Using Notes. Since the beginning of time, taking notes has always been a big part of learning. Note taking is an important skill whether it is done with paper and pencil or with technology. When it comes to the iPad, the Notes app will be a great resource for taking notes over the important information you learn in your classes. Notes is very easy to use, but there are a few features we want to cover today to make sure you are able to use the app to its full potential. To start, you will want to open the Notes app on your iPad. Once you're in Notes, you will have a blank note sheet. Each individual note will be saved as whatever the first line of your note is. For example, I am naming my note, Notes Example. To slide your keyboard down, you will want to click the keyboard button in the bottom right hand corner. Obviously, you can use the keyboard to type your notes, but today we are going to look at the ability to make a checklist, use the sketching feature, and how to add a picture to your notes. First, we will look at the checklist. To turn on the checklist feature, you will click the circle with a check mark in the bottom right hand corner. This will make a list that you are able to check mark as you complete items. The next feature is sketching. To open sketching, you click on the squiggly line button in the bottom right hand corner. Once sketching is open, you have the ability to use the following tools. Pen, marker, pencil, ruler, or eraser. You can also change the color of the sketching by choosing a different color. As you are sketching, you can always use the back arrow in the top left hand corner to go back a step or the forward arrow to redo the action. Once you are happy with what you have sketched, you can click Done and it will add the sketching to the notes page you are working on. The last feature is adding a picture to your notes. If you are typing notes and wanted to add a picture of an example your teacher did in class, you can take a picture of the board and add it in. To do this, you click the camera button in the lower right hand corner. This will give you the option of choosing from the photo library or taking a photo or video. You will choose a picture or take the picture and then click use photo. This will add the picture into your notes for you to look back on. When you are done with notes, you can upload it to your Google Drive by clicking the share button in the upper right hand corner and then clicking Google Drive. If you are done and want to create a new note, you will click the button that is a notepad and pencil in the upper right hand corner. Notes will be a very useful tool for you in the classroom and will be great for keeping your notes all in one place. Your notes will always have the date and time that you last worked on them, but be sure to create a title that you will be able to recall what the notes were over.